Game day for Group D CHL action. ZSC Lions hosting the Herbar AB19. Early power play for Zurich as they work the puck around. A nice shot by Lucas Walmart, who strikes in the opening two and a half minutes. Nico Letnin and Alexander Kexi earn the assist, but the key to the goal was a screen out in front by Yuho Lamiko. Later in this opening period, a shot from the point by Christian Marty is turned away by Dominic Horvath, but on the second look, you get a nice redirect from Justin Segrest. In the second, shorthanded Sven Andragetto would set up a one-time shot by Segrist. Horvath covers the ground to make an excellent glove save, keeping his team within one. Henrik Nielsen's point shot leads to an offensive opportunity for AB19 as Estevan Karabuch slices in towards the net. Shimon Rubitz is able to poke it away. Late in the period, however, AB19 would tie the hockey game. Andrew Serra off ice, enters his own, hands it off to Patrick Newell. And Anze Kuralt gets his first CHL goal late in the second to tie the game 1-1, entering the third. But in the third, it would be all the home team. A shot from the point leads to a mad scramble out in front. A goal is signaled four minutes in, but they're going to have to take a look at the video review. This is the second video review of this hockey game, and this time Zurich gets the call to go their own way. They credit to the goal to Lucas Walmart, his second of the game, and it's 2 1. They would build on the lead from here as Lamiko's shot leads to a rebound. Jerome Backhoffner puts ZSC up by two halfway through the third period. Just a little loose change out in front. Empty net, goalie pulled, five minutes to go as Sven Andragetto is hooked up, still pursues the puck, and he puts it into the empty net for a comfortable three-goal lead. Nielsen was going to get called for the penalty. No power play needed, it says 4-1 Lions. Late in the game, another six on five opportunity, and that will lead to one more empty net goal. Alexander Texier makes it a 5-1 final for ZSC. The Lions now have 10 points, second in Group D.